Hello guys and welcome back to our channel Rescue Digital Media. Today I am here with 7 quick methods to fix can't map network drive Windows 10. But before we get started, like, subscribe and ring the bell icon to notified when our new video lands. Can't map network drive Windows 10 problem usually occurs due to network connectivity issues, restricting firewall or security software, outdated drivers, missing registry values, or outdated system software. Now, let's move on to fix this with 7 best fixes. Solution 1. Check your network connection. Make sure that your computer is connected to the same network as the device you want to map the drive from. If you're on a wireless network, try re-establishing the Wi-Fi connection. If you're on a wired network, check that your Ethernet cable is connected properly. Solution 2. Check for shared folders. Make sure that the folder you want to map is shared on the remote device. If it's not shared, you won't be able to access it from other devices on the network. To share a folder on Windows 10, follow these steps, right-click on the folder you want to share, and select Properties. Click on the Sharing tab. Click on the Share button. Select the users or groups that you want to share the folder with. Choose the level of permission that you want to grant to each user or group. Click on Share to save the changes. Once you've shared the folder, follow the steps to map the drive, open File Explorer. Click on this PC in the left-hand pane. Click on Map Network Drive in the top menu. Choose the drive letter you want to assign to the map drive. In the Folder field, type in the network path to the shared folder, example backslash server name backslash share name. Check the box that says connect using different credentials if you need to enter login credentials. Click on finish to map the drive. Solution 3. Check your firewall settings. Your computer's firewall could be preventing you from accessing the network or the remote device. To check your firewall settings, follow these steps. Open the Windows Defender Firewall by searching for Firewall in the Start menu and selecting Windows Defender Firewall. Click on Allow an app or feature through Windows Defender Firewall in the left-hand pane. Check that the app or feature you want to use is allowed through the firewall. If not, click on Change Settings and check the box next to the app or feature. If the app or feature you want to use is not listed, Click on Allow another app and browse to the program's executable file. Make sure that the checkbox next to the app or feature is checked. And click on Add. Check that the network type, private or public, is set correctly for the network you're connected to. If you're not sure, select Restore Defaults to reset the settings. Click on OK to save the changes. Solution 4. Add the provider flag's registry value. You can add a registry value to your Windows 10 system to enable mapping network drives using older protocols like SMB v1. Here's what to do. Open the registry editor by pressing the Windows key plus R, typing regedit, and hitting enter. Navigate to the following registry key, he underscore local underscore machine backslash system backslash current control set backslash control backslash network provider. Right click on the network provider key and select new. Then word 32 bit value. Name the new value provider flags and press enter. Double click on the provider flags value and set its data to one. Click on OK to save the changes. Close the registry editor. Solution 5. Use Local Group Policy Editor. You can use the Local Group Policy Editor to enable the Enable Insecure Guest Logons policy, which allows your Windows 10 computer to access network devices that are using older protocols like SMB v1. Here are the steps to do so. Press the Windows key plus R. Type pedit.msc and hit enter. Navigate to the following policy. Computer configuration. Then administrative templates. Network. Landman workstation. 
double click on the enable and secure guest logons policy. Select enabled and click on OK to save the changes. Close the local group policy editor. Solution 6. Update the network driver. If the network driver on your computer is outdated or corrupted, it may cause issues with accessing the network or mapping network drives. Here are the steps you can follow to update drivers. Press the Windows key plus X and select Device Manager from the menu. Expand the Network Adapters category and right-click on your network adapter. Select Update Driver from the Context menu. Choose Search Automatically for Updated Driver Software and follow the on-screen instructions. If Windows doesn't find a newer driver, you can try visiting the website of your network adapters manufacturer to download the latest driver. Solution 7. Check Network Discovery Settings Network Discovery is disabled. You may not be able to access network devices or map network drives. To check Network Discovery Settings, follow these steps. Press the Windows key plus I to open the Settings app. Click on Network and Internet. Click on Sharing Options. Under Network Discovery, check the Turn on Network Discovery option. Under File and Printer Sharing, check the Turn on File and Printer Sharing option. Click on Save Changes to save the changes. That's all. Hope you liked this video. Thanks of watching.